Welcome back to Los Angeles here at the Hobby Shop Studios. We're continuing our series on how to's and tips and tricks for the Sonicport VX. This video is going to deal with how to get great acoustic guitar tracks. Okay, so I've got Sonic Port VX on the little stand that it comes with, uh, and I need to adjust some of the switches to make sure that I'm using the right inputs. So, on the side here, you can see I've got electric guitar input, stereo microphones, and mono microphones. So I'm gonna leave it on mono microphone for a second, and this here is my mic gain. So as I position the microphone, I'm gonna to try to put it kind of, you know, 12th, 14th fret kind of thing. And now if I switch over to the iPad, I'm going to launch Cubasis. So Cubasis is an app uh, from Steinberg that allows you to use a lot of different inputs and outputs at the same time. And you can record a lot of different tracks, which is great. And if I click this little arrow there, you get to the routing tab. So you can configure any of these channels to be one or two inputs, be stereo if you want, mono. So I'm just going to record input one, which is the mono microphone. Put this away for a second. And now if I record arm this track, put it into record, and you go to the mixer, see I've got noise. So I can move this microphone anywhere to try to get it to uh, sort of do the right thing for me. So the effect of moving the microphone changes the amount of bass response. So if I move it towards the 12th fret, it's going to get thinner. And if I move it to the low end of the guitar, it's going to get way bassier. So where you put the microphone on the guitar obviously changes the bass response. But I have another option. I can also record it in stereo. So if I move that slider to the middle, I have to reorient the guitar and the microphone because it records in stereo now. So if I tighten the microphone on the stand and just turn it over, there you go. And I come back over to Cubasis and select this track. If you go to the routing, you can see it's stereo input now. So it's listening to both inputs one and two from Sonic Port, not just input one as it was before. And press record. Move the microphone again. And once more. So you can tell that the microphones in the Sonic Port VX sound incredible on acoustic guitar. So uh, check out all the other videos in the series and then head down to your store, pick one up and get recording. Thanks and cheers.